Hello? Hello, everybody. I'm the CTO of Mercurator, Shenzhen. Our topic is launching a new era of in the internet and uh, another new era. And uh, I'm sure you uh, have heard a lot of new eras. So what the hell is this new era? And we believe uh, the value of the internet is made up of millions of developing enterprises. Instead of a few internet giants, let's see two cases. The first one is Snapchat. I'm sure all of you know Facebook. And uh, as all the people uh, continue to enrich Facebook's uh, user count upward, teenagers are increasingly leaving the social media platform uh, in favor of a platform that they feel they have greater uh, control over, Snapchat. If you have a teens in your house and a grandma on Facebook, there is no surprise. Because uh, younger people like to put uh, their share, uh, sharings away from their adults' prying eyes. And there's uh, another example is Chi uh, Toutiao, a Chinese news and uh, videos aggregation mobile application who personalize the audience through artificial intelligence. It, uh, uh, this is uh, that taking the best content from web reworking it and uh, suit the individual's preferences and uh, own reading styles. But we are not talking about AI today. The most uh, important innovation of Chu Tao Tiao is that it encourages the user to uh, share the content uh, in the social media platform and uh, reward the user real money uh, if his or her friend read the content shared by this user. So a user can make money from Chu Tao Tiao. It's very interesting. And uh, we think in this era, more and more people are persuading personal, uh, personality and uh, extreme user experience. So what's the position of blockchain? And a blockchain is a trustworthy infrastructure. The trust is established by the code and algorithm, uh, which is executed on a decentralized platform. And under that background, when a user issues a token, a user could see the value because it's transparent, trustable, sometimes limited. And without blockchain, an enterprise is difficult to perform customer relationship management, especially small enterprise. A user is tend to trust a giant enterprise because branding, but uh, you know the privacy data leak by Facebook, right? So blockchain, changes the production relations between the user and the enterprises. And a user's identity and uh, equity could be guaranteed uh, based on the trustworthy infrastructure. And we believe in this new era, there are two fundamental elements, highly customized user experience and the token-driven mutually beneficial mechanism. And uh, what's the token-driven solution? We think it's an implementation of a growth methodology user attention economy. There are four steps. First, uh, we create the user attention token. We call it UAT, but we do not assume it in vain. Secondly, we scientifically evaluate the user attention, generate user attention value. We call the UAV, and uh, we assume UAT according to the assessment of UAV. And third, with the circulation of UAT, an enterprise could perform tokenized operation. Finally, we use, uh, utilize the token to power the whole ecosystem. We connect the related enterprises and, and the users together. Uh, this is uh, the most important slide. We call it the golden triangle of user incentive. And the more effective, uh, effective user behavior on your product the better commercialization opportunity your product uh, has. Uh, this means your product could make more profits, so you can uh, give more reward to the users who contribute the profits. And the more reward the user get, the more attention the user will focus on your product. This is a positive feedback driven by token. Okay, I think the sequence is not right. Uh, I'll explain this first. Suppose uh, every enterprise adapts the token-driven solution. Imagine that a user could earn the token 
through reading content by a um, news application, and then use this token to buy e-books from an uh, e-commerce website. This is interesting, right? And uh, uh, with a value network, uh, a company, uh, an enterprise called only focus on its uh, own familiar domain, and there are uh, a lot of third-party vertical services enterprises, and none is dominating. Uh, this gives the, the enterprise flexibility to choose the partnership. So what uh, has stopped us now? And uh, we think it's the massive gap between the enterprise demand and uh, the public chain technology. Uh, first in public chain, and uh, we think at first uh, the value between the nodes should uh, be agreed upon the business itself, uh, not transaction fee, not minus reward. And, and enterprise cannot accept unpredictable unpredic uh, infrastructure cost. And the second, we think the data should be permission access, and um, enterprise could uh, share the data to its users and uh, its alliance, but not all enterprises. Finally, uh, throughput and latency always be the problem uh, in uh, most, uh, most all of the production ready public blockchain. So here's our solution, asset mapping. A multi-tier architecture with multi-chain and multi-asset. In the above, we have massive internet users who connects the internet enterprises application, which is responsible for evaluate user attention value and trigger the circulation of UAT. The UAVs record and the UAT circulation happen in the middle tire we call the internet asset tire. We built this tire based on open source consortium blockchain technology. The TPS could be up to 1,000 per second. And uh, the bottom, we still have public chain asset layer. We still uh, issue the token on the public chain, Ethereum, because uh, at the beginning, we think the ecosystem is not big enough to attract, uh, attract the user to use the UAT. So we need to provide a public marketing uh, circulation to the user attention token and give the user the uh, ability to exchange the user attention token to the, public, uh, to the token we issued in public chain or any other public chain tokens issued by our customers. So this is our solution. And uh, this is Merculate, uh, the chief growth officer of Global Entrepreneur. So we hope we can create a future together. Okay, uh, any question?